to have you with us as we get ready for a Monday afternoon presentation of the NBA on 2K Sports. This is Brian Anderson. I'm here with Hall of Famers Grant Hill and Doris Burke, our reporter, Allie LaForce. It's the Portland Trailblazers facing the Indiana Pacers. So here's Portland's starting group. We've got Damian Lillard, and it's Walton in its center filling out the middle. Daniels passes to Lewis. Here's Granger. Three-pointer. On target from range. And that's what they want to do. Get him open looks early. Lillard looking around. The three. The Pacers pull it in. O'Neal passes to George. Over Lillard. Nice shot by George. Yeah, I love the way Paul George fights for position on the interior. Here's Roy. George defending. Lillard, a screen on George. Here's Roy. Deflected. And here's George from 18 feet away. No good there. Well, he's a quality mid-range shooter, but he can't get that one to go. And we're about a minute and a half into the first quarter. Lillard outside. Knocks it down from distance. And that's a veteran move by Lillard to see the D closing and get the shot away. Here's Lewis, defended by Lillard. Count it. One for one to start the game. Just taking it right to the rim, and no one was there to greet him. But I think defensively, that is not the way you want to start. Giving up high percentage looks, that doesn't typically end well. Now here's Lillard. And again, it's the Trailblazers from deep. Lillard gets so much lift on his three-pointers, it's almost effortless how he shoots. Here's Lewis, defended by Lillard. George for three, and again, it's the Pacers from deep. Both teams are starting to find a rhythm here. And this is partly what the game has become, right? A matter of dueling three-point opportunities. Here's Walton, pass to Roy. Now Lillard takes the three, and again, it's the Trailblazers from deep. Just a big time answer from Lillard. He competes as hard as anyone in this league. Here's Lewis, defended by Lillard. Here's O'Neal. Another one falls for Indiana. And hitting from the mid range here and early. I mean, really gives the defense just another thing to worry about. They're basically saying, you're going to have to guard us at every point on the floor tonight if you're going to have any chance. Here's Lillard. The Pacers making their last shot. Roy can't get it to go. O'Neal on the wing. Pass to Lewis. Now here's George from deep. And again, it's Indiana with a three. Uh, Paul George's shooting form is just so pretty. This guy's ability to make shots so easy. Now Lillard, nine points in the game. Let's go with a three. O'Neal pulls it in. Indiana leading. They've been taking care of business. Especially at the offensive end, where they've been totally in sync. That shot is good, Lewis. Oh, just an easy reverse for him. He has nice feel and touch around the bucket. Lillard fires away from way outside. The long distance three is buried. The range Dame possesses is exceptional. That's what it takes to be logo Lillard. Pass to O'Neal. For three, George. It's hauled in by the Trailblazers. Lillard outside. Takes it inside. Soft touch off the glass. Lillard's got 14. Inside, Lillard can deliver. He's a skilled finisher. Here's Lewis, defended by Lillard. 
Here's Paxson. Always a nice way to start. Makes his first one. Such a multi-talented threat on the offensive end, and you love his confidence. Inside. It's picked off. Here's Paxson. Pass to Lillard. George with it. Here's O'Neal. Here's Daniels. Yet to see a basket. Five to shoot. For three, George fires in the triple. You have got to have the right focus and the right reads in the pick and roll. And Paul George making all the right decisions right now, slicing up the defense. Now here's Lillard. He's got 14. No good on the triple. Here's Lewis. Oladipo's checked in for Indiana. And also a switch here for Portland. Porter Jr.'s checked in. Daniels passes to Granger. Back to Daniels. Pass to George. Four on the clock. That one's good for two. 13 points in the game. Yeah, Paul George, a tremendous jump shooter. Squares up, knocks it down. The defense has got to be better. Lillard against Oladipo. Lillard passes to Walton. Outside Porter. Here's Roy. Baseline jumper. And the jumper is good. And both teams already firing on all cylinders. Yeah, this is already a high-scoring game, but we knew that was a possibility coming into this one. Here's O'Neal. And Walton pulls it down. And for him, that's a great look. Expect him to go right back to it if it's available. Well, no doubt. Very good play call, good execution. Sometimes it just doesn't fall. Pass to Lillard. And here is Porter. George defending. Fires from 14. Doesn't go for him. And so it's Indiana with it. They lead by four. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. We call that masterful use of the pump fake. Paul George effective getting guys to jump on it. And he can't get the first one. I think the experience Paul George possesses is so valuable to his team. This guy is such a seasoned vet. He hits the second from the line. Portland trailing here. Now here's Porter. Still no points. Here's Lillard. Set it up with a fake, but it's offline. O'Neal passes to Oladipo. Here's O'Neal, defended by Lillard. And he makes no mistake. Slam. Standing pass on time and on target. And it's the Trailblazers ball. Timeout called. Portland. Paul George with a strong contribution so far in this one. And I think a new plan would be a good idea. At least make it hard on this guy. Attention fans. Now on the court is your Drexler passes to Porter. Here's Walton. 
Back to Porter. Down low. Here's Drexler. Always a nice way to start. Makes his first one. What a terrific pass. Work the ball inside and create a good look for your teammate. Lillard against Oladipo. George outside. Fires the three. And it's Portland with a rebound. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. Outside Porter. Back to Lillard. Six to shoot. Blocked! Here's O'Neal. Pass to Daniels. And George with the jam. Well, that's about timing and precision and knowing for Paul George how to use that leaping ability to get that alley-oop. Walton passes to Porter. Driving in. After missing his first attempt, now one for two. The value of good ball movement isn't lost on this squad. George against Porter. George passes to Oladipo. Back to George. Indiana needs to get a shot off. Got a hand on it. And so it looks like the Pacers will retain possession here. Here's Busey, and they force the shot clock violation. Great D. Now Portland with it. It's a five-point game. Two minutes remaining in the first two minutes. On the wing, Porter. Money on the 19-footer. Defensively, you can't afford to get stuck on the pick. You know exactly what that takes. It takes energy, it takes activity, it takes intensity. Now the Blazers on the move. Here's Roy, and he takes the feed in stride and slams it home. That's just perfect execution. Nice job hustling, and as a result, he gets rewarded with the bucket. You don't give the defense any chance to set up. Sometimes you just love an easy look. He just rises up and throws it down hard with one hand. That is such a go-to move for him. He holds nothing back on those. The Trailblazers making a switch here. Sabonis checked in. One shot. And that one misses. Now Portland with it. They trail by three. To the middle. Here's Porter. Pass to Sabonis. Oh, and a fast break for the Pacers. Here's Boosie. Here's Granger. The three is up. Oh, he missed it. Making him one for two now. 59 seconds left in the first quarter. Launches a three. Porter shot is off. And even after airtight defense like that, you still just expect him to hit those kind of shots. Out to the wing. Here's Granger. From 20 feet. It's rebounded by Sabonis. Now here's Porter. Tight defense on him. Knocked away. In transition. Here come the Pacers. Here's Boosie. After missing his first attempt, now one for two. What an incredible ankle breaker to help create space for his shot. Porter with it. Takes a 13-footer. Oladipo with the rebound. To the inside. 
Down it goes. Jam that one home. Well, known for being a terrific passer, he shows you right there. Case in point. And so it's Indiana closing out this quarter with a seven-point lead. And it's all due to their ability to own the paint. They've been dominant down low. We'll be right back. And for those of you just tuning in, second quarter action is where we are. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for Indiana. Well, hey, guys, I mean, can we talk about how unselfish they've been just racking up the assist numbers, moving it around with great precision? Well, also, guys, what a start from beyond the arc. A huge part of their game today. That's going to help their spacing. Indiana leading. Here are the five. Portland has to start the second. We've got LaMarcus Aldridge. And it's Roy in at the two spot. McGinnis, no good. Here's Portland now. Here's Drexler. The ball's knocked loose. Here's our test. Pass to Granger. Here's Boosie. He's guarded by Porter. A shot from the mid-range. And that one's good. That makes him two for three. Busey's gotten two of his three shots to go tonight. Outside Porter. There's a screen by Aldridge. Right side Porter. Aldridge outside. Down to five on the shot clock. Pacers with a rebound. Well, the defense flat out awful right there, and he couldn't punish them for their mistake. Here's Boosie. He's guarded by Porter. Ranger passes to Daniels. Yep, that one's good. And it's an 11-point Indiana lead. That's been the story of their offense so far. Getting a number of looks from point-blank range. Pass to Aldridge. Cash. Assisting on the play was Porter. Porter's got his third assist of the night. Such a nice touch on the ball from Aldridge. He knows exactly how much power to put on the inside shot. Here's Boosie. There's a screen. Up and over Porter. Here's Granger. The three. Connects from downtown. Rangers got six. And just totally relentless, only increasing the intensity level. One thing I enjoy is watching players who don't pay attention to the score. You lock in on the moment and play the right way. Pass to Roy. There's a screen by Aldridge. Roy's shot is good. He's got six. Indiana on offense. And we're now a little over two and a half minutes into the second. Boosie passes to McGinnis. Here's Boosie. He's guarded by Porter. Pass to McGinnis. Here's Daniels. Here's Boosie. Three-pointer, no good. Here's Roy. Six points for him. Now Sabonis. Aldridge outside. Rebounded by Daniels. Daniels has got six rebounds now in the game. And let's send it over to Ali LaForce. Brian, among the new trophies introduced last year, no doubt the Michael Jordan trophy given to the league MVP is the most distinctive. And while its design elements honor aspects of Jordan's great career, he asked that the trophy not be fashioned in his likeness. Instead, Brian, the hope is for each recipient to be able to see themselves in the award. All right, Allie, love that. Thanks. And so here's Portland. 
Following the bucket by the Pacers. Aldridge down low. Nice. Gets his second bucket. He's two for four now. Oh, what a crafty move. Causing the defender to pause right there. And he lobs it up to the rim. Three on three. Here's Drexler. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting. So he'll take two free throws. <laughs> Man, the defender really went after him. Shooting for Portland, Clyde Drexler, taking two shots. And he makes a first. The Pacers making a switch here. Lewis has checked in. That one falls, so he hits both of them. It's not luck that he's so steady at the line. It's through repetition and hard work. Got a piece of it. Damn, that one's good. Lewis has got six. And he's just crushing them with plays like that. I mean, just continuing to pile it on. You want to make sure your opponent knows they have absolutely zero chance of a comeback. And nice finish by him. Here's Paxson. He takes it in. Dunks it hard with one hand. Wow, he makes it look easy. And what an aggressive move to the rim. He's really trying to fire up his teammates right now. Boy, it's not hard to feel inspired after a teammate makes that kind of finish. Where was the defense? No help. You can't afford to give up these kinds of buckets. Rejected by Sabonis. Pass to Paxson. Picked by Sabonis. Just five on the clock. Elbow shot. Paxson can't get it to go. And that's where you want to make the next pass. This guy is a good scorer, but the defense was right on him. Here's Lewis. He has six. Over to the wing. Here's McGinnis. Over to Bonus. McGinnis, no good. Roy. He's got six. Picked by Sabonis from the arc. Buries it from three. Roy's got five points now in the quarter. Gotta fight harder to get over those screens. You know, we see this all the time. You're basically, as a defender, hoping the man misses rather than putting in the work to get over screens. Time called here. Indiana decides to talk it over. Substitution on the court. Here's Lewis, defended by Lillard. Lewis passes to O'Neal. Let's it go from the baseline and nails it. O'Neal's got six points. No one there to contest. Didn't really need the fade. Now here's Lillard. Defense is right there. Fires from deep. Rebounded by Daniels. Daniels has got his eighth rebound here tonight. Pass to Lewis. Here's O'Neal. Fades. It's hauled in by Paxson. When it goes in, it looks pretty. When it doesn't, question the shot difficulty. Walton. And the shot goes in. Walton's gotten his first basket of the night. And you know Lillard loves setting up his guys. He's got a great eye for where to move the ball. Here's Lewis, defended by Lillard. Steps back. Oladipo outside. Clock at four. Let's it go from deep. Oh, clanks that one. He's 0 for 1 to start. And it's Lillard with a ball for Portland. 
It's a five-point game. It's stolen. Pass to Daniels. Throw it down on the breakaway jam. When you get a chance to run the floor like that, you have to capitalize. Great hustle on that play. And here's Lillard. He's got 14. He's off on that one. And he's going for the oop here. Throw it down on the lob. Woo! <laughs> I just love that alley-oop slam, B.A. Defense disorganized. Defense pays. There's a screen. Lillard fires away from way outside. Again, the miss by the Trailblazers. Oladipo outside. Pass to our test. Back to Oladipo. Five on the clock. Back to O'Neal. Fires the three. Tries again. There's the block. And so it looks like the Pacers will retain possession here. And that shot was going nowhere thanks to that aggressive swat. Yeah, what a play. I mean, that'll have the offense thinking twice about taking shots in his presence. On the court for the Pacers, number 45, Chuck Person. Shot clock at six. The floater. That shot is good by O'Neal. O'Neal's got eight. Well, that's a nice play. You've got to read the situation and go to your floater game when necessary. They set the pick. Here's Drexler. The Pacers pull it in. Daniels has got 11 rebounds in the game. Here's Lewis. Six points for him. And he finishes. That makes him four out of five. Now a timeout called by Portland. Yeah, they're hoping to turn things around with this timeout. Yeah, this is why you hate to lose momentum. It can be hard to get it back. Here's Roy. Nine points in the game. Looking to end the run. And he converts the layup. Walton's got four points in the quarter. This is what we call highly efficient play. Working off the screen, getting to the cup. Here's Lewis. Give him eight. And he drains it. A solid five for six now. And the defense has no one to blame but themselves. I mean, they just let him get right to the rim. To me, this has simply stated been a complete lack of defensive attention and focus all night long. Here's Roy. Lillard, a screen on George. And the foul called on Paul George. That's his first foul of the game. Second team foul. One forty-three left in the second. Pass to Roy. Shot clock at five. To the paint. Intercepted! I just don't love the passing angle there. Might have been better to reset. Here's O'Neal. George outside. They set the screen, lets it fly. Portland grabs the miss. Here's Paxson. Pass to Lillard. Here's Paxson. Here's Roy. Ooh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. At the line for the Trailblazers, Brandon Roy. 
two shots. No good on the free throw. And the second free throw is good. There's 47 seconds left in the first half of basketball. Here's Lewis, defended by Lillard. With the fadeaway. That shot is good by O'Neal. O'Neal's got 10. And he can get that shot any time. He really can shoot over almost anyone. You want that mid-range game in your arsenal. You can't just be about freeze and dunk. Sometimes this is a key shot. Now here's Lillard. He's got 14. The baseline J is on the way. It's rebounded by Indiana. Daniels has got 12 rebounds here tonight. Big time effort. Pass to Lewis. And he drives in. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. 12 points for him. Well, you get exactly what you want right there. Clean look right at the cup. Nicely done. Deflects the pass. And it's out of bounds to the Trailblazers as Portland retains possession. They got very fortunate there, guys. They should just take their time on offense and not try to force things. For three, here's Lillard. That misses. Would have counted had it gone. And so it's Indiana in control with a 16-point advantage heading into the break. They put in work down low, getting in close and scoring in bunches. We'll be right back after this word. And with the second half upon us, we'll find out if this game becomes the route that it's threatening to be. Paul George has been sensational. Yeah, they've done an amazing job of creating room to operate for him. And then, of course, executing. And one of the things every player is after is efficiency at the offensive end. And boy, this young guy has done just that. We've got Paul George, and it's Daniels in at the pivot spot, batting the middle. So that's the group out there for Indiana. George left side, and the Pacers tack on two more. Well, that's where Paul George simply refuses to let the defense alter his shot or impede his concentration. So good. Now here's Lillard. Here's the pick. Pass to Walton. Good. And it's Lillard who picks up the assist. Lillard's got three assists in the game. Probably a play they drew up in the locker room at half. Well, there is nothing better than catching a rhythm as early as possible. And boy, that's a terrific start right there. Ranger, no good. And so it's Lillard who brings up the ball for the Portland Trailblazers. They trail by 16. O'Neal pulls it in. And here are the Pacers now. Back to George. Pass to Daniels. Here's O'Neal. It's hauled in by Paxson. Lillard with the ball. To the wing, right side. Here's Walton. Oh, and he brings it down with a two-handed jam. And I love the balance for Lillard between scoring and passing. That time, finding his teammate for the great look. Kicks it to George. Pass to Lewis. For three. No luck on that one. Two minutes into the second half of play now. 
Here's Paxson. Ball stolen. Here's Daniels. He's got 10. From downtown. And once again, off the mark by Indiana. Now Portland with it. They've only allowed two points so far in the second half. Well, what a terrific possession. Attack in the painted area. How about the unselfishness of this team? <laughs> yeah, the willingness to make the next pass has this defense scrambling. Gets the three to fall. George has got 21 points in the game. Are you kidding me? Just look at what Paul George is doing to the defense over and over. My goodness. And there's the screen. Here's Roy. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. At the line for the trailblazers, Brandon Roy taking two shots. That free throw, no good. And he sinks the second. Here's Lewis. He's got 12. Pass to O'Neal. The fader. It's cleared by Damian Lillard. Boy, no idea why he went with the fadeaway. Had a clean look at the basket. Wing shot on the way. Portland, no good that time either. He's got a nice feel for that crossover, but you still have to finish. Here's Lewis, defended by Lillard. Here's Granger from outside the arc. It's hauled in by Lucas. Lucas has got five rebounds in the game. They set a pick. Let's it go from the wing, and Lillard gets it to go. Lillard's got 16 points now. Second half here, and we're just over three and a half minutes into it. Pass to Daniels. Back to George. Inside. Lays it up and in off the pretty assist. Rangers got his third basket of the night. Well, there you see Paul George as a facilitator. He can create his own, or he can get somebody else open. Lillard outside. Oh, and he nails it from the high post. Lillard's got four points now in the quarter. Defensively, you can't afford to get stuck on the pick. You know exactly what that takes. It takes energy, it takes activity, it takes intensity. Here's Lewis. 12 points for him. George outside. Jacks up a three, and the three-pointer goes. George has got 24. And this is how he shines. He's a big part of their floor spacing. And right now, Greg, he is doing a great job delivering for this team. Productive and efficient. Out to Lillard. Pass to Roy. Six on the shot clock. Lucas passes to Walton. Here's Roy. And right away, they match it with a three-pointer of their own. He's got 14. Man, this is just fun. These teams are trading threes back and forth. Well, that three-point shot just gives you so much room to operate on the offensive end. Time called here. Indiana decides to talk it over. Daniels passes to George. Here's Lewis, defended by Lillard. Pass to Lewis, beyond the arc. Yes, and it's George picking up the assist. Lewis has got 15 points. Well, he showed right there. This guy capable of making shots, especially if you leave him that wide open. Lillard passes to Paxson. Here's Walton. Here's Roy. Again, the Trailblazers. Good for two. He's getting to his spots and executing. Just making the game look easy. George passes to Granger. Offline with a three. And just terrible defense. I don't know how he missed that shot. Pass to Lillard. Here's Roy. 
16 points for him. Off target with the open look. Here's Daniels. It's deflected. Oh, you better shoot that. For three, here's Lillard. Ooh, Lillard doing damage outside. And you see why he's one of the top scorers in the league. Lillard does it in so many ways. Lewis passes to O'Neal. George outside. O'Neal inside. And it's Portland with a rebound. Great contest by the defender. But that's a dunk you've got to put down in his face. Pass to Roy. Lillard, a screen on George. Back to Lillard. Puts up a three. And again, it's Portland with a three. And what an impact he's making from beyond the arc. A big three-pointer to narrow this lead. That's where the bulk of his offense has come from. And they're going to need a few more of them before this one's over. Victor Oladipo is checked in for Lewis. Porter Jr., he's checked in for Portland. Substitution on the court. Lillard against Oladipo. Here's Granger. Counted from distance. Granger's got five points now in the quarter. Such a reliable threat from range. You'd think the defense might key on him a little bit more. Lillard outside. Here's Roy. He's got 16. That one rolls around and rims out. Here's O'Neal, defended by Lillard. Oladipo, the pass to O'Neal. Back to Oladipo. And he lobs it up top! And is blocked. Porter in the post. George defending. Porter shot is off. Indiana on offense. They led by as many as 18. George passes to Oladipo. Back to George. They double team George. Pass to Granger. Just five to shoot. Fires for three. It's hauled in by Lucas. Lucas has got rebound number seven tonight. Here's Roy. Oh, swiped away. In transition. Here come the Pacers. Here's Oladipo. Counted. And Indiana leads by 12. And a closer look here at the hustle stats for Indiana. Well, their D has been a major story tonight. I mean, those steals and putting pressure on the ball, clogging the passing lanes, impressive. And their fast break has also been a key metric in this one. They have had a significant advantage in transition over the course of this game. And it's going to be out of bounds. Portland will have another go. Just a superb read on defense to come up with the block. Oh, showing no signs of giving up this lead. That block sends shockwaves into the opposition sails. Here's Walton. Give him eight. Four on the clock. Here's Roy. Oh, that bucket gives him his seventh field goal in 12 tries. Well, the problem is they haven't gotten production from any other spot. But right now, this guy is cooking. Here's Busey, defended by Lillard. And George launches it from deep. And it's Portland with a rebound. Lucas has got rebound number eight here already in the game. Here's Roy. 18 points for him. And with that one, the deficit trimmed to single digits. Roy's got 10 points now, just in this quarter. He's bringing a lot of energy to this offense, not letting the scoreboard discourage him right now. And to me, he's just playing smart, efficient basketball, really helping his team hang around this one. Now here's Porter. Pass to Lucas. And here's Lillard. Here's Walton. There's a minute 54 left in the third quarter. Misfires there. Four for six in the game now. Here's Boosie.
Here's O'Neal. It's good. He's six for 12 from the floor. And he couldn't get an easier shot. The defense right now just looks defeated. Well, simply stated, simply not enough effort. Not enough attention to detail. They've gotten run over this evening. Here's Roy. 20 points for him. Count it. The name of the game isn't scoring. It's scoring efficiency. Here's Boosie, defended by Lillard. Oh, there's the alley! Here's Porter, and it's Portland scoring again! And despite the defender's length, he goes right up from the mid-range. Well, I'll tell you, I love that he's not afraid to take on the size mismatch there, Greg. It doesn't matter, just make shots. Good, on the bucket. George has got 10 points in just the second half. Paul George just so fluid offensively. What a pretty move right there. Pass to Roy. Down low. Ranger grabs the miss. Well, we love his ability to attack the rim. He just loses a little bit of focus and misses the chippy. And we've got 28 seconds left in the third quarter. Here's the floater. Now Lillard, he's got 24. Up again. And <laughs> those second chance buckets are major bonus points if you can get them. And we've watched three so far in this one. It's the Pacers, they lead by six. And we'll return shortly. And while we have a chance, let's go to our State Farm assist of the game. Now, I know he's a big man, but he's got some point guard in him if he's making passes like this. I'll tell you, in today's game, you want skill and decision making at every position. And with three quarters behind us, we'll start the fourth in what is still anybody's ball game. On the court right now for Portland, we've got LaMarcus Aldridge, and it's Paxson in at the shooting guard. Remarkable effort level from Aldridge. He understands how to create second chance opportunities. Here's Lewis. Tipped. Pass to Drexler. Here's Paxson. Here's Walton. Lays it up and banks it in. Zero rim protection. Unforgivable in a tight ball game like this. You know, we talk about execution offensively coming down the stretch. To me, it's as important defensively, and they didn't have it. Gets the three ball to go. Cool, calm, and collected at a critical juncture in this game. Now here's Porter. The D's right on him. Here's Paxson. Here's Aldridge. And then Aldridge with the dunk. <laughs> and plays like that one can make the difference in a close game. And it definitely got the bench on their feet, too. So credit him for going for it, not settling, saying, I'm going to attack. They are unconscious from outside. And so far, the defense has had no answer. Well, that's the whole point, isn't it? If you space the floor well enough, it's almost impossible for the defense to account for everyone. And this is just typical of him, always making an impact at crucial moments in the game. And this is a player who understands when the game is hanging in the balance, he knows it's winning time. Nails it from three. They're really employing a deep range initiative here in the fourth, and it's working. It feels like they have worked their perimeter game to perfection, swinging the ball, cashing in from the outside. What a performance. Just under two and a half minutes gone by now in the final quarter. Here's Daniels, and there's the slam! Dunk to finish it off. 
Slams it down with two hands. Man, they're really getting aggressive now. Pass to Aldridge. Count that one. He's scoring at a nice clip. He's six of nine tonight. And you can feel the temperature rising in this arena. Both teams pouring it on offensively. There's been a bit of a flurry here late, and this game may come down to which side gets a stop or two. Now here's Porter. Here's Drexler. Out to the right wing. Aldridge. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. And he knocks down the first one. George, he's checked in for Indiana. And so Aldridge nails them both. To have a big who's great at the line, such a plus. Now a timeout called by Indiana. And let's swing it over to the sideline and hear from Allie. Hi, guys. The head coach for Indiana had some instruction for his guys during the break. Despite the lead, coach was stern with the guys, mentioning to the team, do not let up. I've seen some big comebacks in this league, and this is not over. An interesting message. B.A.? Thank you for that, Allie. Now here's George. Here's Daniels. And the layup falls. As usual, terrific effort from him. Unwilling to let the possession go to waste. Over three and a half minutes through the final quarter now. Drexler passes to Lucas. Quarter a screen. Five on the clock. With his first shot attempt. Lucas can't get it to go. Indiana leading. George outside. George draws the double. Here's McGinnis. And it's Portland with a rebound. Here's Paxson. Nice move. And he was fouled in the act of shooting. Opportunity for a three-point play here. This right here. Whew. This is how you want to play the game. With passion, with energy. Just great hustle play right there. Here's Lewis. Pass to George. There's the triple with the putback. Controls the rebound and the putback. And Indiana leads by six. Great effort to turn the miss into two points. Yes, sir. Those are the hustle points. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. Yeah, inside Lillard is just so scrappy. Turning aggressive defense into a foul while shooting. And both free throws good for Lillard. Now here's George. Tries it from the top of the key. And perfection right through the net. George has got 12 points here in the second half. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. It takes incredible effort to stay connected to the hip of the offensive player. You've got to want to work. Here's Lucas. Lillard outside. Launches it. Sinks the tray. Lillard's got 29. <laughs> What's incredible, he doesn't need much space to let it fly. Lillard's shooting touch does wonders for his team spacing. Pass to Granger. Three-pointer. It's good. Set up beautifully by George. George has got his third assist of the night. Here's Paxson. George defending. Lillard outside. Let's watch Dave here. Yeah, defensively, you think Lillard's going to hunt for the three ball, but then he puts it on the floor and just attacks. For the Trailblazers, Damian Lillard. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Free throw good, Lillard. Yeah, I think something that doesn't get appreciated enough is Lillard's patience. But he's not one to rush things or look for easy outs. 
he knows it takes hard work to succeed. The Pacers making a switch here. Oladipo's checked in. And so he hits both. They're just trying to hold on to this lead, Grant. And right now, you just can't afford to be careless. George outside. And again, it's the Pacers from deep. This guy practically automatic. Paul George in the catch and shoot. Look out. Here's Roy. George defending. Roy's shot is good. Here's George. The 15 footer. Drexler grabs the board. Pass to Lillard. Here's Drexler. Back to Lillard. A bonus the pass to Lillard clock at six the three is up Pacers with a rebound George has got four rebounds now Oladipo outside here's O'Neal and down it goes dumped it through off a beautiful setup and you can get a real sense that Victor Oladipo loves sharing the wealth what a nice look pass to Lillard Portland scoring again. So it's the Pacers now. They led by as many as 18. Oladipo with the ball. Here's George. Basket is good with the setup from Oladipo. Oladipo's got assist number five here tonight. Timeout called. The Blazers. Paul George with a strong contribution so far in this one. They really need to reshape their defense. They have to get out to him quicker to slow his three-point attack. Daniels is checked in for Indiana. <laughs> Lewis comes in for Oladipo. Here's Roy. George defending. Lillard outside. And there's a pick. Goes up from the top of the key. Yep, right through the net. Lillard's got 35 in the game. Scoring this much while shooting this well. Insane. Pass to Daniels. They double team George. Here's Lewis. And there's the lob. Out of bounds. It'll be Portland's ball. Well, when you're careless with the basketball, you can expect that to happen. And it's Lillard with a ball for Portland. It's a five-point game. Fires from the wing. Walton passes to Paxson. Here's Lucas. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Lillard. Again, the Trailblazers. Good for two. I'll tell you, he is just the focal point of this offense. Lillard, I mean, just so diverse in the many ways that he can score. Here's Lewis. It's hauled in by the Trailblazers. Lucas has got 11 rebounds in the game. Boy, the offense has been on point. <laughs> they have great timing and great communication. So hard to get stops against them. Yeah, you never want to let shots at the rim go uncontested. Shooting from Portland, Brandon Roy taking two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he drops the first.
and that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Here's Lewis. Pass to Daniels. Now here's George. There's the drive. O'Neal passes to George. Six on the shot clock. George draws the double. Here's Granger. Here's O'Neal. Good. And he's hit 8 of 14 now. A solid offensive performance. Well, you love the persistence on the offensive glass. All about effort right now. Lillard, left side. Pass to Lucas. Here's Roy. Lillard outside. The shot is good, and this game is back to even. Lillard's got 40 points. Oh, in pressure moments, he's a guy you trust to make big shots. Here's Granger. They double-team George. The three ball. Shot's good by Granger. And they retake the lead with a bounce-back three. And Portland has possession. Lillard outside. Here's Roy with the drive. And he takes that one up and powers it through. <laughs> so sick, the vertical ability. That was flat out awesome. He has that effortless knack for getting to the hoop. Offensive board. Pass to Daniels. George outside. Let's the three fly. It's hauled in by Paxson. Paxson's got five rebounds in the game. Now here's Lillard. Guarded closely. To take the lead. Lillard converting inside. It's game time. Whenever this team needs a big shot, he knows how to get one. To the middle. It's intercepted. Pass to Walton. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. First one, and that'll put him up two. So he gets them both, and it's a three point game. You get the sense this guy relishes getting to the free throw line in these tough moments. You talk about clutch, this guy is it. To the inside, to the right side, 4-3, and he sinks it. Oh, a tremendous three! We're tied! <laughs> talk about stepping up in a big way. I'll tell you, it takes confidence to pull the trigger in that situation. You love guys who relish the moment. And the Trailblazers call time here. There's 47 seconds left in the fourth quarter here. Here's Walton. Count it! I just love the aggressive finish. Now I'm thinking he's sending a strong message with that jam. Time called here. Indiana decides to talk it over. They're losing by two. There's 42 seconds left in the fourth quarter.
Here's Lewis, defended by Lillard. Lewis passes to O'Neal. And he's going for the lob! Dives for it. There's the steal. Shot clock and game clock separated by less than six seconds. And now they decide to foul intentionally. So the first one drops, and that makes it a three-point lead. Second one is good, getting both at the line. And it's a four-point ball game. Yeah, the crucial part of those free throws is that it now makes it a two-possession game. Time called here. The Pacers decide to talk it over. They're trailing by four. 26 seconds left to play in the fourth quarter of this one. Just two seconds between the shot clock and the game clock. The Pacers again can't hit. And now an intentional foul. They need the ball back as soon as possible. Yeah, and that was a smart move. I mean, you have to foul right there. You just don't want them to run out the clock. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Oh, he doesn't hit the first. That was the one they really wanted. He's got one more, though. That's good. Going one of two from the line. And that puts him up five. There's 21 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Here's Lewis. Defended by Lillard. Cash! What a beautiful shot! Brings him within three! Well, the touch and the focus. What a pretty move in the lane. And they stop the clock as soon as they can with the intentional foul. First free throw is good. And that gives him a four-point cushion. And so both free throws good. And it's a five-point game. That's what you call slamming the door. This one is over. Lewis passes to Daniels. There's the three. That one no good. So it's Portland picking up the win. And they barely squeezed out the win here on the road. And B.A., the visiting team is always under some added pressure. But they made it work and got the win, whatever the margin may have been. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. For Doris Burke, Allie LaForce, and Grant Hill, and all of our crew, this is Brian Anderson thanking you for watching this 2K Sports presentation of the NBA. Now our New Balance player of the game. Damian Lillard.